advised, Executor. Our forces are divided. Alderis has taken control of our Templar warriors and arbiters. It is possible that he may even send Archons against us. Fear not, comrades, for we have Archons of our own. Should the dire need arise, all Dark Templar may merge to become Dark Archons. Though we sacrifice our warriors in doing so, only the might of the Dark Archons can match the forces of Aldaris. It is finished, Judicator. Surrender your remaining forces and join us in eradicating the Zerg. I would sooner die, Dark One, than tarnish the memory of Ayer by joining with you. Your fate was sealed the moment your matriarch allied herself with the Queen of Blades. Those of us still loyal to Ayer will never be slaves to Kerrigan and her broods. Alderis, be reasonable. Kerrigan has changed. She no longer seeks to enslave anyone. Do not force us to destroy you. You can no longer afford to be so naive, Artanis. While you were securing the crystals, I discovered that your matriarch has been harboring a dark secret. She has been manipulated we by have this- no time for this. I just cleaned up your mess, Frotas. Don't be so squeamish. Wretched creature. This was a Protoss matter. You had no right to interfere. Be gone from this world. You are no longer welcome among us. Fine. I've done what I came here to do. I've ensured the destruction of the renegade Cerebrates, and I used you to do it. Have fun, mighty Protoss. We'll be seeing each other again real soon. This entire chain of events has been masterminded by Kerrigan, and we played right into her hands. Yes, we did, Artemis. Yet our course is set, nonetheless. Using the Temple's energies against the Renegade Zerg may accomplish Kerrigan's aims, but it is still our only chance of survival. And survive we will, my warriors. For too long have we labored in futile defense, as our enemies push us further and further away from victory. The time has come to let loose the full fury of our powers. Never again shall Shakuris be despoiled by the foul touch of alien species. These Zerg shall be the first to fall before us. Matriarch, I have served you for many millennia. I have always valued your wisdom and strength. Yet, lately, in your mind, I have sensed something that clouds your true spirit. Though Kerrigan has gone, I wonder if her treachery still remains. Be at ease, Zeratul. I am still the same Rashagon you have always known. These recent events have weighed heavily upon me, and I am wearied. But fear not. My warrior spirit will shine before you and light your path to victory. Indeed. The time for action is upon us. The crystals must be taken to the temple while the Zerg still muster their forces. I shall carry the Urash myself, while Zeratul handles the callus. Executor, you shall provide escort for Artanis and Zeratul as they make their way to the temple. God's willing, we will channel the energies of the Zelmaga and scour this world clean of the Zerg. Go now, my children, and know that the survival of our entire race depends upon your actions. When you bring the crystals to the temple, the Zerg will surely send all their legions to destroy you. You must be prepared to protect the temple itself from the swarm. The rush is secured. The palace is secured. Executor. Zeratul and I will begin to channel the temple's energies. You must prevent the Zerg from destroying the temple while we work. Adun be with you, Executor. A 
executor, the channeling is complete. Withdraw our forces into the temple and brace yourself. <laughs>